In this video, I'm gonna show you how to walk on a tile roof without breaking it. And I'm even gonna show you how to break a tile by walking on it improperly. So let's get into it. Before we get on the tile roof, I wanna show you a few concepts that we're gonna be discussing. The first one is the distribution of weight. So when you're walking on a roof, I'm over 200 pounds. So if I'm standing on just one foot, 200 pounds is gonna be on one foot, on one pressure point, on one tile. Now if I stand on two feet and spread my weight out, I'm gonna have 100 pounds per foot. If I go a step further and spread my feet out in such a way where my toe is on part of a tile and my heel is on the other part of the tile, now each tile is carrying 50 pounds of weight. So that's gonna be a concept that we're gonna um, walk on the roof. We wanna distribute the weight as much as possible. The second thing you wanna be aware of is making sure that wherever you're stepping on is distributing the weight all the way to the bottom. And what I mean by that is tiles are floating. One tile is sitting on the other tile. This lip is sitting on this lip. So if you stand right here, the weight is moving from this tile to the tile below down to the solid wood deck. However, if you stand right here, you've got an empty spot right here. So now this tile is gonna split and crack in half as opposed to having the weight distributed all the way to the bottom and not break. You ready? Let's give it a try. Now I'm gonna actually start walking on the tile roof, watch my feet placement and how I try to spread my weight out on two feet. So generally what I try to do is keep half my weight on my toes and half my weight on the heels. Separated two leg, that's gonna distribute your weight properly. If you're walking on a flat tile, you don't have to worry about that. And the last thing is, when walking on a tile roof, a lot of times walking on the ridge makes sense as well. Uh, these tiles along the ridge are sitting right on the roof. So walking on here helps. It's an easy place to walk and makes you feel comfortable that you've got both legs, one leg on each side. Lastly, as I promised, what not to do and how to break a tile. Don't try this at home. <laughs> Dang, bro. That's a good tile. It's not what I expected. Well. That was very satisfying. In my next video, I'm gonna show you how to replace what I just broke. If you guys have ever had trouble or broken tiles while walking on a roof, leave a comment below. I'd love to hear your story.